what is up guys this is karan here welcome back to tech karan youtube channel if you have a device which didn't got the miui 12 update yet you can install this build which is called miui hellas by miui 12 20.10.15 weekly beta which you can install right now a lot of devices are supported right now i'm using redmi note 9 pro which has this build as a port rom but some of the devices are officially supported for this like redmi note 8 redmi note 80 redmi note 7 redmi note 7 pro some other devices also the link for all the devices is in the description and is it worthy to install this build by unlocking your bootloader and installing a custom recovery on your device i'm gonna share with you a lot of things about this build so let's get started so guys if we talk about this build actually i have applied a third party theme not actually a third party theme which is available in the theme store i'll try to provide the link in the description for this theme you might love this theme the link is in the description you can go and install this and if you don't know how to install this theme on your device if you use this build which is miui hellas you can easily import the theme and apply it directly if you use any stock room or other things like that you can simply use the miui theme editor for that the link for that video is also in the description you can go and install this right now i'm using this latest miui 12.2 by xiaomi miui gr for redmi note 9 pro it's available as a port room for other devices it might be available as official one also so you can go and install that link for all those things is in the description if we talk about this build is it worthy to install this build right now on a device let me show you the things which you get here if we talk about the control center yes it is available here actually i have applied this normal miui 11 control center miui 11 quick settings which looks better by the way but yes you can install that one also let me show you by going into settings here if you go to the display in previous builds if you talk about some beta builds if you go to the display option you will see your full screen mode and you will see the hide notch and control center option but now it's shifted here notifications and control center which ui looks very interesting you can choose the control center style to old version or the new version so yes almost every feature from mio 12 is available here it's better to unlock your bootloader install a custom recovery and install this build now i have just chosen this one you also got the option of switching the control center side so yes you can easily switch the control center side to here or here you can simply choose by default it will be from the right side as we have just enabled the switch from here so you will see your control center like this i've enabled the th third party theme so that's why these styles are looking like this but looks better of course you can easily use these kind of themes if you want to also we have a lot of extra things available here let me tell you which are the things you get here notification sheet which you can customize if you go to the notification shade you can easily expand the top notification which is very interesting things uh, and also you can choose the notification style to miui or android it's better to choose the android one so you can easily apply directly from the notifications which i sometimes use in avsp rooms so it's one of the great things out there also we have the smart home option available i don't have these kind of things so i cannot show you if you go to the status bar option we have a lot of extra options available too show notification icons lte icon hide notch you can also hide the notch if you want to there are a lot of things here which you can do if you want to moving on to the wallpaper section we have the super wallpapers available too by default these wallpapers are not supported for a lot of devices including redmi note 8 redmi note 7 i think also redmi note 9 pro is also not supported for these super wallpapers but yes if you install this build you will get super wallpapers available here too by the way, we also got some system wallpapers too. So if you don't want to apply the super wallpapers, you can use these system wallpapers. There are a lot of options available. Geometric, like the normal nature patterns, dynamic nebula, we have the minimalism, black and white, Mars, a lot more things are available. These are the things kind of available in almost every device, whichever you use like Miui Hellas Room. So don't worry about that. If you go to the sound and vibration, we have the main kind of features which you like this in same Miui 12 so almost every feature from minion 12 is present there so no issues here and there if you go to the home screen we have the home screen option to choose a classic one or with app drawer so it's also kind of a really impressive thing it all depends upon you if you want to choose app drawer you can choose app drawer option also swipe up on the home screen you can choose a search one or none it all depends upon you 
home screen search bar option is available here you can customize your minus one screen too there are a lot of options which you can do and by default if you choose the indian build or global stable you will not see these kind of features so yes it's better to choose these kind of things password and security has a face lock fingerprint screen lock almost every feature from neo 12 looks kind of really really interesting screen time option and if you go to the special features we have the floating window we have the game turbo video toolbox second space menu lab and light mode a lot more things are available which you can do on this build it's better to choose this build instead of choosing for waiting for the new bills which are coming i'm not sure when so it's better to choose these kind of things also if you go to the theme store let me tell you about the theme store first of all also this has the almost same kind of chinese theme store out there where you can customize the themes we have a lot of wallpapers including that we have a dynamic wallpapers available too so dynamic wallpapers are kind of really interesting i've applied it on my redmi note 8 device which looks really impressive ringtones fonts and icons options are available too so if you want to customize these kind of things you can also customize theme components lock style status bar icons messaging these kind of things are out there which you can customize if you want to the link for this pair including the theme everything is in the description you can simply go and install this now this is all thanks for watching goodbye